Hi there, this is Ron Gilock, professional network marketer. And if you're watching this video, you're probably brand new to network marketing. So welcome to the industry. This purpose of this video is to welcome you and give you an, an, uh, an uncensored, unbiased account of network marketing, what to expect, what can I do, the good, the bad, and the ugly. So let's, uh, let's jump right into it. First of all, you know, welcome to the industry. This is one of the most powerful things you can ever do in your life. This is a, an industry where you have unlimited income potential. You have the freedom to cr truly create whatever lifestyle it is that you want. You have um, you have the freedom to choose who you want to work with and go on vacation with them and just help other people. So if you're in this and you're not into into helping other people, you just want to get rich quick. Uh, it's probably not for you. But if you like. You understand the the importance and the power of residual income, and you also like helping people. You're in a perfect place. Okay, so I'm going to talk to you about what should I be doing, and a, a little of a, what you can expect. And what's the most powerful and important thing of this video is it's what's going to be going on in your head mentally and, and to prepare you for that. Um, and an important thing to, to understand when starting any new business is oftentimes it's kind of like a bucket of crabs, meaning right now we're all in the same bucket. We're in a bucket of crabs. But if I want to change in my life, I want something better, I want more, I want that financial freedom, myself as a crab is going to have to get out of that I'm going to have to crawl out of that bucket and go out there and get it. You know, go into the ocean and, and experience freedom. I don't want to be trapped in, the, in my cubicle or in my, my bucket the rest of my life. So as I start to do this, as I pull myself out of the out of the bucket of crabs, um, it's a fact that other crabs will start to pull this crab back down. This is why you don't ever need to put a lid on a bucket of crabs. And go ahead and search that if you like. It's a fact. So, and it's the same thing in life. As you have started your brand new network marketing business, you're going to be excited and you're going to want to share this and tell other people about what you're doing and what you're trying to create. And I, I encourage you to do so. But what you're going to encounter is positive and negative um, uh, responses from reactions from people. So let's talk about the negative ones. People who are negative um, are going to say things like, oh, that's a pyramid thing. That's a scam. Oh, I tried that. It didn't work. Um, or oh, you shouldn't be doing that. You know, why don't you go back to school? Or why don't you do the brick and mortar thing? Or why don't you just get a regular job? You know, that's the kind of stuff that you're going to hear. And where this stems from is is some kind of fear. Um, and it's also people that are, you're telling this to love and care about you, and they're trying to protect you. You know, some sometimes they weren't serious enough in their business in the past, and that's why it didn't work out for them. So since it didn't work out for them. Ixo facto, therefore, it must not be able to work out for you and it's a scam, right? See, so this is what's going on in their head. So it's important to understand while all these people are, are meaning to do well to help you and try to protect you and spare you from some kind of pain or something, um, it's just fear-based. And oftentimes as we try to we try to grow, go out and do something that is you know contrary to the status quo, it's uncomfortable. Change is not comfortable, even if it's not the people. Even if it's someone else watching the change that's taking place in us. Um, people are, are a lot. Of, most people are too afraid to actually do something in their own lives to, uh, you know, have that greatness enter in. So they'll be watching you, and they'll be telling you negative things. And, and though some people will, you know, fall off to the side, and others will come on board when they see the change and the powerful, exciting things that are happening in your life. So just encourage, just be, don't be discouraged or, or distraught by uh, somebody telling you something negative or not joining your business. And that's the other thing to, to important to understand that this is the same as any other business that the majority of the people that come through your doors um, are not, are not going to buy or the people that like, like or the people that see your marketing message, not every single one of them is going to buy or you're going to do business with. So just understand that this is a numbers game and the more people that you talk to, the more people that you get eyeballs on the presentation, the better you're going to do. So you're brand new. What do you focus on? You focus on profit producing activities. Don't worry about knowing all the knickknacks and doodads and the shiny uh, benefits and attributes of, of the, the product or compensation plan. As honestly, I've been in network marketing for over two years now and I can't explain my, my compensation plan fully, I, nor do I want to. It just doesn't really interest me. I just know I get a check in the mail. Um, so it's important to to understand that you don't have to know every, every everything. 
You just need to know how to get people to watch your presentation and you need to be able to connect them uh, with your upline leader, your sponsor, and do a three-way call with them to answer questions. Now, this is, this is key. You don't have to know how to explain this business. I don't ever want you to explain this business um, right now because you're, you're brand new. They probably don't want to be doing presentations either. Let your sponsor, let your upline leaders do that until you're comfortable and familiar and familiar with the system and making some money. You know, your first 90 days is critical. This is kind of like the 90 day, um, you know, challenge where you want to create a story that you can share with other people in your first 90 days. You know, hey, I got started in this business and, you know, I just followed what Ron taught me and, you know, I've already made $2,000 or, you know, something like that and I'm, I'm doing this so I can spend more time with my kids and so I can I can coach baseball part-time and, and just retire from my 9 to 5. You know, that's an exciting story. So we're trying to create things like that for you in your life and in your business, okay? Um, now in network marketing, you don't ever want to chase, beg, or bug people to view your opportunity or to join your business. Think about all the professionals that you know that you deal with that are doctors, lawyers, uh, real estate agents, mortgage brokers. None of these people are chasing, begging, or bugging, or hounding you to do business with. Either you're going to do it or you're not, and they're moving on to their next client and prospect. So as a professional network marketer, you need to treat yourself and your business uh, in the same manner and conduct yourself as a professional. So this is why I never chase, beg, or bug. I will contact a person a total of three times um, with my opportunity. After the third time, I usually don't ever reach out to them unless I run into them or they ask me or they have they have specifically asked me to uh, reach out to them again in the future. You know, focus on getting clear yes or no's. The maybes are going to kill you. Now, don't ever get hung up on somebody not joining your business, regardless of how perfect they are or, or you know, how badly you want them to join or, you know, they'll be a rock star and join overnight. They're just so good. Don't worry about that. The people who are going to be serious business builders are, um, are always surprises to me. You know, I really never know who is going to take off. And that's the other important thing to understand with this, that network marketing is a sifting and sorting business. I mean, you're sifting and sorting through people that you know who would be good candidates uh, and good, good network marketers to team up with. So you're recruiting those people and they're joining your business. And out of those people, not all of them are going to produce. Okay, it's just reality. Think about the 80-20 rule. I mean, you're probably familiar with that concept. Now... Um, so 20% of your, your income is going to come from, you know, a handful of your leaders. So look for those who have identified themselves as serious players who are committed to building the business with you and spend your time with them. Spend, you want to focus your time on where it is earned, not where it is deserved. Okay. You, you, I, I, I like to reward people based on production and I spend time with them based on production. You can have a person that is that I, I, I've recruited people that I've regret, I regret that I've br brought on board, um, you know, and, and, and this is the thing, this is part of the bad about network marketing. This is, this is the good and the bad, is that truly anybody can create a six-figure income in network marketing, and truly anybody can have a home-based business, a network marketing business. However, not everyone should have a home-based business. You know, oftentimes because uh, network marketing and, and home-based business companies are fifteen hundred dollars or less to get started, by like, ridiculously cheap, um, the, it's such a low barrier to entry that anybody can have a business. And just because anybody can have a business, they shouldn't. Oftentimes, we treat these five hundred dollar network marketing companies um, like a five hundred dollar hobby, and not with the multi-million dollar potential that it has. Okay, so I hope this has been helpful, insightful on, on your, you know, your, your new journey into, into network marketing. It's going to be an exciting, great time for you. And what's important to understand is that over 90% of the people that have been in network marketing for 10 years are earning over a million dollars a year. Okay. That's powerful. Now you can go to school, get a good job, get good grades, retire rich and enjoy the golden years. Well, if you're in network marketing, you probably found that, that hasn't worked out. So welcome to the industry. Welcome to a life that really does create freedom and possibilities. I'm Ron Gilak. Thanks for checking out this video and make it an awesome day. See ya.